this video we're talking about how to draw the net of a right circular cylinder. We're also going to label the dimensions of the net once we've drawn it. Remember that a net of a three-dimensional figure is basically just the shape of maybe the piece of paper that you would have to fold up to create the three-dimensional object. So we're basically going to transform the three-dimensional object into a two-dimensional shape, and that two-dimensional shape will be the net of this three-dimensional object. And in this particular video, we're dealing with right circular cylinders. So we're starting with a cylinder. The fact that it's right and circular means that the ends of the cylinder are both circles, and that the angle between the base and the top and the sides of the cylinder is a right angle or a 90 degree angle. So we have right circular cylinders, we want to draw the nets. So in this first example here, we have the right circular cylinder. We've been told that the height of the cylinder is four units and that the radius of the base of the cylinder is five units. So how do we draw the net for this? Well, the net for a right circular cylinder is always going to look the same, roughly. We're gonna have a rectangle that represents the side of the cylinder. So if we go ahead and draw a rectangle, maybe something like this, we know the height of that rectangle is going to be four because we've already been told that the height is four. So if you can imagine this rectangle, if we wrap it around on itself to form a cylinder without a top and without a bottom, this can represent the side of the cylinder. Now we just need to represent the top and the bottom of the cylinder, and we'll do that with circles that we attach to the rectangle, so maybe something like this. And if we draw another one on this side, this one can be the base of the cylinder, this one can be the top of the cylinder. Ideally, they should be exactly the same size if you can make them the same size. We can go ahead and label then that the radius here of this circle is five units because we've been told that the radius of the base and therefore the radius of the top also is five units. So we've got the radius of the circular part, we've got the height of the rectangular part. The only other thing that we could label would be the width of this rectangular part. And remember, we're wrapping this rectangular part around itself to create the side of this cylinder. So the width of this rectangle is just gonna be the circumference of the circle or the circumference of the base or the top. So how do we find the circumference? Well, remember, circumference is equal to 2 pi r, where r is the radius. We know the radius is 5, so the circumference is going to be 2 pi times 5, or circumference is going to be 10 pi. So then we can go ahead and label the width of this rectangle as 10 pi, and now we have the dimensions of the net of this right circular cylinder. Let's do one more example here. We have a right circular cylinder with radius four and height 15. So again, we're gonna draw the rectangle that represents the side of the cylinder, and this is gonna be much taller and thinner because we can say that the height is 15 and we know that the radius of each circle is just gonna be four. So then if we wanna go ahead and draw the circular top and bottom on each end, maybe something like this, and then for the base, something like this, and we wanna go ahead and label the radius of the circle, both of these circles, and in a perfect world, they're identical, but we wanna go ahead and label the radius as four, and then we just wanna label the width of this rectangle. Remember, it's circumference, again, so we're gonna get circumference is equal to two pi r. We know the radius is four, so we're gonna get two pi times four, or circumference is gonna be equal to 8 pi, and so again, we can go ahead and label the width of the rectangle here as 8 pi. And now we've got the dimensions of this net for the right circular cylinder. So that's how you draw a net and label the dimensions of a right circular cylinder.